Hey, Space Cadets, Tin Pony here. I'm going to do a quick video on basic flying in the Albion Skunk. Um, start with WASD. W is straight up. S is straight down. A is left. D is right. And that doesn't do any steering at all. Um, to move forward and back, we use the mouse wheel to scroll forward. And we've got a blue bar down here that tells us our speed. If we scroll back, we slow down and eventually go in reverse. Um, there are other cockpit configurations. I'll do a video on that so you can see what they look like. But for now, that's how you move up, down, right, left, and forward and back. To steer, um, we use our mouse to steer, and whatever direction our mouse is, when we hold the left key, mouse key down, um, we're going to turn in the direction of our mouse cursor until we let go of the mouse button and we steer in any direction and the further away the cursor gets the faster we'll turn so there is another steering mode but I don't know. I don't know what it would be useful for. If you press space bar, now the ship is going to turn in the direction of the cursor. Even if we're, we're not putting any other input into it, it will continue to drift towards the cursor. Um, you can use the other the other inputs but if you find yourself in this and, and you want to click on something and your ship is following your cursor and you want to get out of this you can just press spacebar again and your mouse is free now you can hold down the left cursor and steer your ship again um, that's the way I prefer to play because if I want to click on something like this asteroid, um, now I can do that without without my ship moving and following. Um, going to do one more quick thing here. To move forward quickly, um, what we want to do here, just keep an eye on this is a ship status. The blue line is shields, the white line is hull integrity, and when we're moving forward, we can move forward faster. This is top speed. If we hold down tab, now we're moving quite fast, but our shields are draining. So when I let go, the shields stop draining and they start regenerating. So these controls can all be used in conjunction with each other. Um, we can fly vertically, we can fly forward and steer and fly vertically and horizontally or any combination of. So it is a, a very versatile steering system. Okay, so now we know how to fly. Um, that's it for this video. This is Tin Pony. Thanks for watching.